Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel, and this is our famous Bob and Worm underwater sand waterfall, 360 degree viewable, amazing tank. Um, I absolutely love this thing. I'm not going to really give you guys a too much tour of it tonight, so you'll have to watch another video if you want to know all about it. But I just wanted to show you, give you something to look at on a Sunday. What's more to come, we are designing a new waterfall for the freshwater planted CO2 driven Red Sea Peninsula tank that we're working on aquascaping. So we're going to do a really cool big waterfall. Um, and this one over here, I don't know if I'll take it to the shop, but I may, we'll see what happens. But <laughs> I shoved a frag plug in here just to stop this. I wanted to put this tank up against the wall because I wasn't cleaning the back side, but it is pretty cool to have a 360 degree viewable sand waterfall. So if you guys check it out back here, the glass that I didn't clean, and you can just see this amazing river of sand. It just runs all down here. It pours over the side, runs down there. It's so cool. Hits this floating island. Um, so now dep depending on, um, the speed I turn the pump up, I can change the sand and how much sand I have in there. So this is just a simple setup we have. I made it, like I said, just for fun. It wasn't meant to really be anything. Um, the bobbit worm is over here. We did take him out of the sump, so he had to go somewhere. So everybody cried and said, give him a deep sand bed. So I did this. This is a very deep sand bed. And he never seems to go below two inches of the sand, but we gave it to him anyway. I think he likes the waterfall. The view is too nice up top. Why well, go below when you got an awesome view like that? So, and he is the only one in this tank besides the dam damsel and all the snails and that chocolate chip starfish. But, but yeah, he's the king of the castle in here. Look at that. Yeah, it's a little fast right now, but it's still, still cool. So I like to test out and see what kind of corals the chocolate chip eating starfish will eat. And it's pretty interesting what I've seen him munch on. And this Euphilia in here, I have not been able to kill it. It's a green and purple hammer and it's just stunning. So I, I'm very impressed. I haven't done a water change on this thing. Um, barely change the sock once every four months. <laughs> so we've let this thing go crazy. But that's our little update. Here's the refugium underneath. I threw the heater in there. There's the big sock. That's the sump. There's the auto top off down under there. So this thing has it all. One complete setup. Even has the Chinese black box LEDs up top. So, and you have a dial for control. So let's see what happens when I turn this thing up just a little bit. Just a little. There we go. Mega water, sand waterfall. It starts shooting out. I should have put a cover on that side when I built this thing. But you guys can just get the illusion, the feeling of what this thing is kind of resemble for the new display. Um, I'm just absolutely, like I said, mesmerized by this tank. I started off doing a video, had something to say, and then after two minutes of looking at this thing, totally forgot what I was going to say to you guys. So uh, I guess that's a good thing, right? So when you come into the store and you come to check out this creation of a tank that we're building, hopefully you get just as mesmerized as I am. So I hope that that's possible. But, but there you guys go. Little Sunday update. Uh, I'm gonna do another quick video in a second on the 3D printer. I just wanna show you some overflow boxes that I made that I'm pretty proud of. So stay tuned for that video as well. Uh, make sure you tag a friend who's into uh, reefing. Freshwater planted as well. We're gonna have a lot of that coming. So come check us out. Our new store should be doing the grand opening very soon. We did a soft opening this weekend so people were allowed to come in and buy corals and fish tanks and pretty much whatever you want we have available. Just the displays are not ready, but <laughs> all right, guys. That's my that's my Sunday talk. As always, thanks for watching. Happy reefing. Until next time.
If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend. And thank you for being part of the Coralus community.